coffee. Coffee is a wondrous thing. It sustains me in the morning when uh, it's early and I'm tired and I don't want to do my exercises or I don't want to read or I don't want to get going. It's amazing how a little sip of uh, the, the cup of joe can really invigorate us and get us going. There's something else that should sustain us as well, and it's God's Word. You know, I was reading through Hebrews the other day, and the author of Hebrews in chapter 1 says this, The Son, meaning Jesus, is the radiance of God's glory and the exact representation of His being, sustaining all things by His powerful Word. Jesus sustains us through this. And if you're not into this, if you're not into this daily, then you're not being sustained. Just like mornings when I get up and I haven't had my coffee yet, I'm grumpy, I'm grouchy, life is not really that good because I haven't had anything to sustain me yet. No food, no coffee. But our spiritual lives can get that way if we're not sustained through this. So let me challenge you this week as you go through your life. Every morning get up or if the morning's no good for you, do it in the evening before you go to bed. Or find a time in the day when it's best for you. And read the Word. Even if it's only a chapter. Even if it's only five minutes a day. Get into this and be sustained by it. Try that this week.